Hey everyone, welcome back to Endless Money Pits. This is a 2007 Toyota Camry, and today I'll show you how to replace the sun visors. The sun visors in this era of Camry seem to fail often, preventing the visor from holding itself in the up position. I found a good video by Colin Chilibeck that shows exactly why you can't repair Toyota sun visors. I won't be going into that much detail here, but I'll put a link to his video in the description for anyone that's interested. The only tool I needed for this job was a plastic pry bar, and I was able to find a replacement sun visor on Amazon for a surprisingly low price. There are links in the description for everything I used. The driver's side visor in this car has been hanging low for at least 5 years, and you can see where it was rubbing on the owner's forehead, taking some of her makeup with it. It's only gotten worse with time, and a few days ago, it finally just fell off. The arm of the visor is connected to the car with two metal clips. The clips lock into place when this plastic trim piece is pushed up, so to release the clips on the old one, we first need to pry this piece down. Once you've released both sides, the arm should pop right out. Visors with vanity lights will also have a wire here that you'll need to disconnect. Press the new sun visor into place, making sure both clips are in all the way. Then push up on both ends of the plastic trim to secure them. The procedure is the same for both visors. This is an aftermarket visor, so it's not a perfect match to this beige interior, but I'd give it a 4 out of 5 for fabric and color matching, which is good enough for this car. I'll put links to aftermarket and factory visors in the description, so you can decide which one you want to get. You might also want to check out my cabin air filter video if you haven't replaced yours lately. If you liked this video, make sure to subscribe for more of the best DIY videos on the internet. And until next time, just keep throwing money at it.